Hello, everybody. Today, we're going to learn about one story, Jeffrey, Ashley, and Vanessa, they are friends. And now, Jeffrey and Ashley, they want to buy us some gifts for Vanessa, okay? Ethan Crompton, can you read the first paragraph, please? Jeffrey wants to buy a pair of ribbon for, for Vanessa, but he knows Vanessa all time, always. She likes to use different, uh, different clothes. She likes to wear beautiful dress and different things. Um, a pair of pretty hair really goes with her hair. Vemos pues entonces que él quiere comprarle a ella un par de aretes, ¿verdad? Para Vanessa, porque Vanessa siempre se viste con la mejor ropa, siempre se viste siempre bien chévere con sus amigos, cada vez que ella sale con sus amigos, ella siempre le gusta vestir vestido, le gusta estar vestida, usar vestido, ¿verdad? Y un par de aretes realmente le queda muy bien a ella. That's what I think it on Jeffrey. Eso era lo que Jeffrey estaba pensando. Yo le dije a Ethan Cronton, ¿y a quién más que leía el número 2, el párrafo 2? ¿Quién era? Dylan. Fue a ti que te dije, hijo, que leyeras el párrafo 2. Yes. Dylan. Words address when no, she here, goes... No, here, 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 Ashley. Ashley, Ashley wants to buy, buy a pair of shoes for Vanessa, but she is not sure about Vanessa's shoes. Show size. Size my thing. Maybe. My th maybe. Maybe buying a pair of gloves is a full a good idea. idea. She can she can wear wear then he's coming winter. Thank you. Very good, Dylan. And Ethan too. Very good boys, guys. Okay, listen. Actually, she want she wants to buy a pair of shoes for Vanessa, but she's not sure because Vanessa maybe she have a different type of shoes. Maybe she want to buy a pair of gloves because it's a good idea, no? A chicken wear then this coming winter. Entonces vemos que Jeffrey quiere una cosa, pero Vanessa quiere otra. Ahora resulta que, perdón, Ashley quiere otra. Ashley quiere comprar a Vanessa un par de zapatos, pero como ella no sabe cuál es la talla de Ashley, de Vanessa, ella tal vez le vaya a comprar unos guantes porque le parece buena idea y tal vez entonces el invierno venga y ella tenga que usar los guantes. It's a short story here, but we learn many things. For example, we learn that Vanessa and, sorry, and Jeffrey and Ashley, they are good friends. And Vanessa, she's 
maybe she feels so proud because she has a has beautiful friends and she has a big friends that they're all time they are thinking about buy many things for her friends okay for their friends entonces vemos que ellos ella tiene uno ella debe estar contenta y orgullosa porque tiene unos amigos aprendemos pues de que ella tiene unos amigos super chévere muy lindos que quieren comprarle a ella muchas cosas y quieren con, piensan en ella pues. Así que, and now we're going to solve the page number 48 on the down part. And we're going to read again and complete the sentence. Vamos a leer nuevamente este párrafo, lo voy a leer esta vez. Y vamos a completar las oraciones que están allí. Ok. Jeffrey wants to buy a pair of earrings for Vanessa. Vanessa always wears a dress when she goes out with her friends. A pair of pretty earrings really goes with, with her. Ashley wants to buy a pair of shoes for Vanessa, but she is not sure about Vanessa to sign. Maybe buying a pair of gloves is a good idea and she can wear them with this coming winter. Repeat one more time. Jeffrey wants to buy a pair of earrings for Vanessa. Vanessa always wear a dress when she goes out, a, she goes out with her friends. A pair of pretty earrings really goes well with her. Ashley wants to buy a pair of shoes for Vanessa, but she is not sure about Vanessa's two sides. Maybe buying a pair of gloves is a good idea. She can wear them this coming winter. One more time. Jeffrey wants to buy a pair of earrings for Vanessa. Vanessa always wears a dress when she goes out with her friends. A pair of pretty earrings really goes well with her. Ashley wants to buy a pair of shoes for Vanessa, but she is not sure about Vanessa's shoe size. Maybe buying a purple glove is a good idea. She can wear them this coming winter. Now fast. Jeffrey wants to buy a pair of reading for Vanessa. Vanessa always wears a dress when she goes out with her friends. A pair of pretty earrings really goes well with her. Ashley wants to buy a pair of shoes for Vanessa, but she's not sure herself about Vanessa about Vanessa's two side. Maybe buying a pair of gloves is a good idea to can wear them this coming winter. Thank you so much. And now we're going to solve that page. Wait a moment, wait a moment. Okay, on the page number 14, 14 student book, página 14, we have a Vanessa here, we have a Ashley here, and we have a Jeffrey here. There are the three friends. Vanessa, Ashley, and Jeffrey, and they are talking about different schedule, okay? Ellos están hablando de cómo son sus rutinas diarias, cómo ellos hacen cada uno, okay? On the page number 22, en la página 22, we are talking here about Jeffrey and Vanessa, but Jeffrey, he is writing a card, a postcard, or I don't know, maybe a letter for his friend. His friend. Entonces vemos allí que a Vanessa ya entonces Vanessa con Jeffrey, pero solamente aparece Jeffrey que le está escribiendo una historia, una carta a Vanessa porque él está allá, yo creo que en Los Ángeles, en Estados Unidos, y él está explicando cómo es allá el tiempo, cómo es el tiempo allá y cómo es el tiempo allá en donde está Vanessa, que ella está creo que en Taiwán. Así que vemos la gran diferencia. On the page number... Tori, que es la parte 30, vemos allí a Ashley y a Vanessa... Ashley and Vanessa, they are talking about the summer camp of Live English School. Ellas tienen como un campamento de verano y están hablando acerca de ese campamento y cómo les va a cada uno, si una le, ayuda, le gusta ayudar en la casa, si otra no, si una levanta la mesa, etc. On the page number now, 40, que es lo que estaba hablando Anthony, we are talking about Vanessa and Jeffrey, they are talking together. They are together talking about difference to the school in the United States and the school on the Taiwan. Entonces, vemos la diferencia de las escuelas en las que ellos están, que es lo que te comentaba. Y nos saltamos entonces a la siguiente página, que es esta, en la que viene el cumpleaños de Vanessa y quieren, quieren hacerle un regalo, pero ellos no están, no están seguros de que si le compran un par de... What happened, Christian? What happened to you? 
What happened in your eyes? Are you talking? Are you kidding me right now? Me estás bromeando. Come on. Ok, vemos entonces que si le compra los guantes, si le compra unos aretes, él quiere comprar unos aretes. Si le compra unos aretes, porque ella anda vistiendo bien. O le compra unos zapatos, pero no me se la talla, así que mejor le compro unos guantes. Entonces, ahí vemos. Más adelante vemos qué pasa con esos amigos. Ok, guys. Share my screen with you because I have the same page, page that you have. Okay, tengo la misma página de ustedes. If you pay attention, we're going to read again and complete the sentence. Ya la leímos porque leí, 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 leí en lento, suave, mediano, pequeño. Lento, suave, mediano, pequeño. Okay. Ashley want to buy for Vanessa. Okay. Tell me something. Binyami. Ashley wants to buy what things to Vanessa. ¿Qué le quiere comprar a Ashley a Vanessa? ¿Qué es lo que realmente le va a comprar a Ashley a Vanessa? Shoes. What? Shoes. No, no. Ashley, Ashley. Earring is Jeffrey. But Ashley wants to buy what thing? Here, ve. Look at me. Something they put on their hat, algo que te pones en las manos. What is that? In Spanish, if you don't know. Look at me. Thank you. Yeah. And now we're going to write there. Guantes. Yes. Okay, we're going to write here a pair. Because it's different. A pair. Listen to me. No is glove. Don't write gloves. It's a pair. Porque hablamos de dos. Acuérdense que pair lo usamos cuando hablamos de dos cosas. Okay. We're going to write here a pair of glove. Yes. Right there, a pair of glove. Yes. A pair of gloves. Ashley want to buy a pair of gloves for Vanessa. And now Jeffrey wants to buy for Vanessa. So Langel, do you remember what is one Jeffrey wants to buy? No harete. Yeah, thank you. A pair of earrings. Repeat, is a pair. A pair. I sorry, no, it's pair. It's pair. Wait a moment. It's pair. Of earrings. Yes. Thank you, Solange. It's true, a pair of earrings. Yeah. Very good. Next. Sofia, Ashley wants to buy for Vanessa, but she is not sure about her shoe size. Ella no sabe la talla de qué, qué ella quiere comprarle. Sofia, tell me. Ella no sabe la talla de los zapatos de ella. Thank you, yes. A pair of shoes is true. Thank you, Sofia. Of shoes, very good. <laughs> okay, guys, I'm going to write here pair of shoes. Very good. And last, Jose Saavedra. Answer me. Vanessa always wears a when she goes out, of, out with her friend. ¿Qué es lo que siempre utiliza Vanessa cuando ella va a salir con sus amigas? Jose Saavedra. Um, dress. Thank you. Very good. Thank you, Saavedra. Oh, you are smart today. Oh, my God. ¿Qué comieron hoy que están todos brillantes? Ah, dress. Thank you. No is a pair. ¿Vieron que aquí no lleva pair? You know why? We, why not? Because we are talking about a dress. No a pair because it's not two. Ella no usa dos vestidos. Ella solamente utiliza uno. 
Okay, repeat one more time. Ashley wants to buy a pair of gloves for Vanessa. Jeffrey wants to buy a pair of earrings for Vanessa. Ashley wants to buy a pair of shoes for Vanessa, but she's not sure about her shoe size. Vanessa always wears a dress when she goes out with her friends. Finish. Okay, guys. If you don't finish, look the video.